students in this class we are going to see SAR of sulfonamides so this is a structure of sulfonamide what is that it is having benzene ring and in first position it is having SO2 NH2 group and in fourth position it is having NH2 so free amino group is present in the fourth position and in the first position it is having SO2 NH2 group it is having structural similarity with PABA that is para amino benzoic acid so what is that in first position it is having acid for PABA whereas for sulfonamide it is SO2 NH2 same fourth position it is having same groups amino group is present in these two so it is having structural similarity with para amino benzoic acid what is meant by sulfanilamido group here we have only NH so benzene ring in fourth position we have NH2 and in first position we have SO2 NH so that is called as sulf anil amido group so this would be very very important so that is the minimal structural requirement for antibacterial activity of all the sulfonamides and in fourth position it is having free amino group no that would be very very important that should be free if it can be replaced by any other groups means it should be reconverted back to free amino group example succinyl amido group acetamido or thalyl amido group N4 acetylated metabolites or sulfonamides are inactive here we have amino and sulfonyl groups that should be para to each other they should not be ortho or meta to each other because they are at 1 2 I mean in ortho or 1 3 means they are at meta means they are very less active and here we have sulfur no that should be directly attached to the benzene ring already we have aromatic ring and that is having SO2 NH in the first position and NH2 in the fourth position so other than this any other substitution on the aromatic ring or if we are replacing the benzene ring by other ring what happens activity would be decreased or abolished here we have N1 no so with the N1 if we are substituting heterocyclic aromatic nucleus what happens act potency would be increased in the case of first nitrogen there may be di substitution means we are getting inactive compound because one nitrogen is essential for ionization and to get maximum antibacterial activity the pka value should be between 6.6 to 7.4 if we are increasing the lipid solubility what happens the half life and antibacterial activity of the sulfonamide increases that is all about the SAR of sulfonamide.